The dish I'll be preparing for you today is goy duck or king clam. This dish is reminiscent of my childhood when I used to visit California from Hawaii. I used to visit my grandfather's two brothers. They would go out in the morning in Nipoma, California and dig for clams. I never went with them, but I would surely eat their bounty. Come join me as I prepare two dishes of gooey duck. After the gooey duck is cleaned from its shell, and after the gooey duck is open, it'll look like this. This is the insides of the gooey duck, and this here, this is the sweetest part. This is the siphon. So what I'm going to be doing is I'll be cutting this section off and making sashimi. With this section, I'll be making fried gooey duck with tempura batter. Here is my knife, and then I will cut this part off. Okay, I'll put this somewhere else on the side while I cut the siphon. So the way I'll cut this siphon is I'll go down the middle, cut it straight like that, and cut this off right here and right here. Then you can cut thin pieces for your sashimi. Thins as thin slices as you can. Here we have a delicious plate of sashimi gooey duck. Okay, I'll make a sauce for it. So the sauce that I will put on it is soy sauce. And you can do it to your taste. Everyone can make their own. And then I add a little bit of lemon. Squeeze the lemon, add a touch of sesame oil, just a little drop, and there you go. It's simple. Then you can grab a plate, get a little of the sashimi, put it on the plate, of course you have to eat it with rice, but we'll just put a little here. You can put the sauce on. And then you can sprinkle it with salt and pepper. Okay. Like this. That's all it is. Let's try it. There it is. It's soft, sweet, a taste of ocean, but yet sweet. It's my favorite. Now I'll be cooking you some clam strips with the other part of the king clam. What I'm gonna do is cut it into little strips and make some tempura fried king clam. People can also make soup with this, but I will make tempura 
king clam. Okay, I'll put this on the side and I'll start cutting up the rest. Get your bowls and put your flour, eggs, and panko mix and dip that together to make a batter. These are breaded tempura ready for frying. You will put some oil in your pot and make sure it is heated. Sizzle. Doesn't that look great? It's sizzling. Our first batch looks great. Now I'm going to put the second batch in. The geoduck is finally prepared. Doesn't it look delicious? So let's try it and see how it tastes. Mmm. It's sweet, it's crunchy, it's soft, it's like the ocean. It's the best clams ever. Like I said, I love king clams or gooey duck, and you will too.